Alright. The first thing we need to do is contact the people that were known to have been near the crime scene. Why? To see if they had seen any craters. If someone saw a crater, this crater would likely have been the murderer. And if they can tell us the color of the crater, we'll be that close to figuring out who this murderer was. Oh, not working on that. You want to see me, Marco? Yes, Forrest. I just wanted to tell you how proud of you I've been. You don't need to be proud of me. I'm just happy to be a part of this. I know you are. This world is going to pay for its corruption. Even though we're taking down the president, other people have to die to show the world that we mean business. What do you want me to do? I want you to go and kill people around this city. Fear leads to intelligence. I'll start immediately. Hmm. I want some pizza. What the hell? Eh, there must be a connection problem. It's alright! It's okay! Don't shoot me! Crater! Look! Listen to me! I didn't come here to hurt anyone! Holy sweet God, it is a crater. Hang on, people. If you're not trying to hurt anyone, then why the hell did you come here? To help you. I know what's going on. I can stop it. You know who's behind this? Tell me. There's a group of craters. And they're led by a crater named Marco. And how do you know that? Because I've been working for him. Look, I believe differently than the rest of you. In my opinion, this world deserves to pay for a lot of things. But now, things have gone too far. Marco's beginning to kill innocent people. Things have gone to his head. He's on a blind rampage now. And I can't let him continue this. Tell me what you know. What's going on here? Crater. It's alright, Alex. He doesn't want to hurt anyone. I don't care. Ah! Uh, Alex, calm down already. <laughs> if you really wanted to fight me, the first thing you should have tried to do was rip my arm off. Nah, I wouldn't want to make a mess on my shirt. Alright, Crater, tell us what you know. I know that unless we stop him, someone in my group is going to kill a man named Chris Tondal. Chris Tondal? That's my cousin. Walden, we need to save him now. Hang on, there's something else. At our base, there's a list. And this list has the names of everyone that works in our group. If we can get this list, you can arrest everyone, including the creators that I don't even know that are in this group. Having a list of the names of all the creators and people that are involved in this organization isn't going to help very much if we don't know where they all are. Yeah, I know. I know. You're probably not even going to be able to arrest half of these people. But it'll at least be able to help you arrest some of them. What's your name? Why the hell should I tell you? Relax. When this is all over and we take you into custody, we'll let you escape. It'll be between us. My name's Forrest. Forrest. How do you plan on obtaining this letter? I was going to go to my group's base and get it. It's our base, but... I don't think any of the creators ever stay there, unless it's for some sort of meeting. But, I would like an extra hand, in case things got hectic. Alright, Alex, 
You go with Forrest and get the letter. Fine. But first let me call Chris. You won't be able to call him. What? Marco disconnected his phone line in case someone tried to warn him. Then I'll have to drive to his house and get him. Relax, Alex. I'll take care of that for you. You came to this agency to help us, so let me do something in return. Alright, we shouldn't waste any time. Let's go. Walton, why do you want me to go with him? You are a Marine. So I get the feeling that as far as guys with guns go, you're the most professional of us here. I just think you should go, in case this ends up being dangerous. Alright. Alright, we're here. Alright, let's just go inside. It's going to be a few minutes before we make it to the room. Fine. So... Why exactly did you decide to stop working for Marco? Because the man's gone crazy. He's lost his morals. Marco was a good man. He used to believe in things. Justice. I've killed people. We all have killed people in our group. People that deserve to die. You can justify your actions in whatever way you want to. You asked about it. Call me crazy, but you seem like a very grumpy person. What's your story? <laughs> My story. <laughs> um, about uh, two and a half years ago, I was a Marine. My wife and um, one year old daughter were on a plane. They were coming to see me. That same night, um, the uh, plane crashed and um, uh, there weren't any survivors so a plane crashed they killed your family yeah and you don't blame the government no I don't well planes were invented right but they're not used for emergencies planes are used most of the time to travel from place to place which you could easily do in a car Cars I can forgive, but planes should not be legal. Let me ask you this. How many lives have planes actually saved compared to the deaths that they've caused? The government doesn't care about our lives. All that they care about is making money. If you're going to start telling me that no one in this country is innocent, don't waste your breath. We all have flaws. It's not about flaws. It's about people's refusal to accept things and take responsibility. Instead, they make the same mistakes over and over again. That's why planes are still legal. God bless America. Alright, the letter should be in this room. Alright, we have it. Let's go. Both of you, put your guns down and come with me. Son of a bitch. I just called Marco. He's gonna come here and decide what to do with you two. Forrest, I didn't expect that you of all people would become a traitor. No, Elson. You're the traitor. You, Marco, and the rest of the men. Marco is just taking this a step deeper. You simply decided to change your allegiance because the going got tough. I never wanted to go against you people. And the fact that I'm doing it hurts very much. But I'm doing the right thing. No, Forrest, you're not. Now shut up until Marco gets here. Alright. As much as I'd welcome the opportunity to die with open arms, we need to get that letter. I agree. Should we stay here for a few minutes? No, we'll have no hope then. As soon as Marco gets here, he'll use us for whatever he wants, then he'll kill us. 
There's no way that both of us are going to make it out of this alive. What are you saying? Get the letter. Find Marco. Ah! Forrest! No!